have a phone market? Ain't that uh <laughs> them who love to have like four, Two, like four, three phones. four phones? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to stay in touch with family and friends? Uh-huh. Yes, the phone that, market. That put that song in a new perspective. It I does. got two, two phones. Nah. Nigeria got more than two. <laughs> <laughs> What's good, y'all? It's the Duma Shats React, and we're back with another video. Who we got today, C? Today, we're back with another American reaction. Super excited about this video, guys. If you're new to us and, and we're new to you, make sure you scroll down, hit, hit that, that subscribe button, button, and turn on the post notification bell because we're, we're on the road to 100k. And we cannot get there without you guys. All right, join the family. Without further ado, let's get into the video. What is it that you enjoy most when you visit a new city? What exactly will you do so you could say, yes, I enjoyed the city? I don't is know. For me, I think it's first... <laughs> yeah, it's a question. I got to answer it. Oh. Can't let that fly. Right. What is something you enjoy most when you visit a new city? I think it's the scenery. First thing I do when I walk into a new city, a.k.a. a new home, it's the city. You know what hmm. I'm saying? The view. Mine I mean, is the, the culture. View. Mine is the culture. I want to know the people. I want to know how they t speak, how they cook, um, what they think about life, what they think about their home. Right, I right, want right. to know the culture. Right. So, like, when you walk in a house, you instantly notice the culture of the house? Mm-hmm. Nice. I notice if somebody's clean or not. Mm. That's culture. I like the view. <laughs> I guess we're on the same That's page. Culture. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. I like that. Culture, the architecture, the shopping, or the other activities. Well, I think you should explore everything that a city has to offer. And today, let me share with you seven adventurous outdoor activities you should explore when you visit the city of Abuja in Nigeria. And this may not be the regular things that you are used to, but I guarantee you something that you're going to enjoy. My name is David, and if you're meeting for the first time, please consider subscribing to my channel to join and be part of this community. Check out other content that we also have on the channel might be something that you might find interesting and if you're part of this channel already please don't forget to like this content drop a comment and as well share it on your social media thank you so much now let's go back to the video hiking and aerobics is the first on our list on the things you should explore when you visit Abuja, Nigeria every Saturday hundreds of young people explore the city hills rocks and mountain. This is becoming a favorite outdoor activity in Abuja every Saturday. For many people it is a time and a way for them to relieve stress, while for others it's an opportunity for them to meet, on, connect with new people and make some new business connection. Why also for others it is time for them to admire and enjoy the breathtaking nature view that you get especially when you get to that mountain top. To participate in any of these hiking activities, you can join any of the Abuja hiking groups that you can find on Instagram. Many of them are already on Instagram. But the most popular one is the Ninja Adventurers and they charge only 500 Naira to participate. To participate, you can follow them on their Instagram and check out when they have hiking opportunities and normally they meet in a particular, in a particular point in Abuja and from there they kick up for the hiking so you can join any of these hiking activities that's coming up on saturdays all right now i like this that's different okay i like it mm. at first i wasn't fully understanding what they had to pay for but okay i get it i understand yeah so this is my question so we're seeing that a lot of africans love to hike um and we do have hiking groups here um but the water what are y'all what is your relationship with water <laughs> i no, think it's cool enough cool enough look like it okay because i was gonna ask what are what are the percentage of people who know how to swim there 
Mm. Because I feel like here we have it's it's not, I can't really say it's a stereotype when it comes to swimming, but a lot of our people learn to swim later in life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can agree with that. Yeah, yeah. because of the fear of water. So I don't know if it's a fear though. Not fear of water because we get in the tub now. We take a bath. We clean. Yeah, I don't think it's a fear. <laughs> I think uh, but just by looking at it, I. I'm taking it as if this is like in a routine of having fun yeah. and enjoying yourself while hiking. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? So cool this enough. experience yeah. could be a little more, you know, upbeat than being like, we're just up this hill we, walking. We weren't up here. Uh, it's a spray. Now. Everybody starts putting on off. <laughs> you know? So, yeah, they look like they're having a lot of fun. Yeah. <laughs> No matter what the least is for you to go for a riding, you can do this by going for either exploring boat riding, hawks riding, or kayaking. Okay. The Boat Club yeah, offers you one of the best experience when it comes to boat riding in Abuja, Nigeria. For hawks riding, you can also check out the Jabe Park Resort. Or if you have some extra money to spend, then you should definitely go to Ahmad Farms. They have some of their bags and horses, and the place also you can ride. Which horse. one would you pick first though? Would you go on a jet ski or would you go horseback? Horseback. I've done horseback before. Horseback. Um, but I was still pick it. What the jet ski? Nah, the oh, horseback, horseback ride. Oh horseback. yeah, I'm getting on the horse. I don't do the jet, but but you say which one I would choose first. Yeah, yeah. I'll get on the horse. Yeah, the horse is dope. The dilemma about Ahmad Farms, you can check out this video that we've already done up here. Charlie then gave the horse tail a little design with his hair. <laughs> For kayaking, it's something a lot of people are already trying out right now. And Amazon Kayak seems to be offering some of the best experience yeah, in this area. Okay. That's different. Well, you already know there are only two people that ever walked on water. Jesus and Ooh, Peter. Oh, that look fun. But you can partially walk on water when you visit that. this place. Yeah, <laughs> If you're yet to subscribe to this channel, please subscribe and be a part of this community. Don't also forget to like, share this video on your social network. The third on the list is for you to enjoy an organized street fight called Dambi. Dambi hosts this Sunday. I thought that was Sunday. canceled, y'all. What happened? Yeah. I, thought, I thought this was canceled. Because we reacted to this long ago. You reacted to it. And do we bring our babies to events like this or this is oh, not kid yeah. friendly? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's because, a good question. Um, yeah, they into sports, mm -hmm. but I don't want to, you know, I just want to know if this is like an actual family event that yeah, you can take kids yeah, to. Yeah, we, we see y'all y'all, extreme fighters. It's like, and again, it's like boxing. Street you know? fight, so, yeah, yeah. Our street fight. Yeah. Yeah. Community in Abuja known as Day Day. Fee to the arena is just 500 naira. If you like some kind of adrenaline rush, then some, this is something you need to check out. But if you're chicken hearted and you don't like to see broken nose and jaw, then definitely you have to move on to the next one. Nah. If you want to learn more about <laughs> Dambi, well, they, they, videos I've done about Dambi. No, not the, the broken nose is not fair. Oh, really. Lord. Uh, mm. You don't want torture. <laughs> Traumatized, not torture. Um, but they say it's like martial arts. Okay, I can understand that. And uh, it's an entertainment, mostly practiced in the northern part. Okay. okay. Entertainment. Yeah. Are you Little entertaining yet? Entertainment, you know. It's right here. You can check it out. Number four and not least is for you to enjoy the city view. And one of the best ways for you to enjoy the city view is to take a ride on one of the tricycles in Nigeria that we call Keke. You will definitely get a better view of the city when you ride in any of those tricycles than when you ride on the Taizu. Apart from getting a better view, you also have some kind of a new experience because of the open doors of the Keke and you get to enjoy some fresh nature breeze. We'll this one is still like you should definitely right. try out, especially if you have not ridden on Keke before. Unfortunately, Keke is not allowed in some part of the city center, but you can still ride it in places like Asokoro, Iriawan, Apo, Gudu, and all of those places are within the town. So jump into any one of these Keke and make sure you enjoy the city view. Another way also you can enjoy the city view is to take a ride on the train. If you have not experienced train ride in Abuja, then you need to really check out this one. You can ride the train within the city, moving from Itu train station to Kuba, or you can do an interstate ride where you move from Abuja to Kaduna. Trust me, this is a lot of fun when you try to ride a train in Abuja. Huh, okay. A lot of fun. 
lot of fun. I gotta see what's going on with that. Number five on our list is for you to go for shopping. Oh yes, this definitely works. Everybody likes shopping, especially the ladies and the men that love them. So let's break this down. If you love an adventure and would like to try out some local market, then definitely you should try out places like Kalu Fish Market, Wuse and Gariki Market. If you want to shop for gift items, then you can visit places like Celebration Cards and Gifts. If you want to shop for phones, then you can visit places like Barnes Plaza. If you want to shop for cultural artifacts, then you can visit you places like... I just got to tease our little, our not, not little, our Nigerian supporters mm. uh, uh, real quick about their phones. Y'all have a phone market? Ain't that uh them who love to have like two, four, three phones, four phones <laughs> yeah. to stay in touch with family and friends? Uh huh. Yes, the phone that, market. That put that song in a new perspective. It I does. got two, two phones. Nah, Nigeria got more than two. <laughs> <laughs> Act and Crab Village. Oh, sorry. Art and Craft Village are permanently closed. But you can oh, still visit places like Jetty, African right, Art, and Craft Market to get some beautiful African Art and Craft. Abuja also have lots of malls that you can enjoy and if you want to learn about malls in Abuja you can also check out this video I've done about malls. Number six on our list is for you to explore the food. One thing that you should definitely try when you visit Abuja, Nigeria is to try out the indigenous food that Nigeria has to offer. I mean, Nigeria has a lot of different kinds of food. But some of the ones that I would recommend that you should try out would be the jello rice, the father rice, the butter garlic brown, the bolly, the roasted plantain, yam and egg sauce, different kinds of soups, ranging from the Igusi, Indikai Gohan, Oha soup, and also the Sunda street food called Abacha. Like I said, there are definitely a lot of Nigerian food that you can try out, but this is the one that I would recommend that you should try out anytime you are in the city of Abuja, Nigeria. Number seven on our list is for you to explore the nightlife in Abuja. Abuja is busy at night and people do all kinds of things to enjoy the night. In this video, I recommend you try out a karaoke music night. You can easily find people hosting this on Instagram. But two places that regularly host this is a cube calf. This make me want to tear up. Yeah. This makes me want to tear up. I'm not going to do it. I'm not. An American restaurant and lodge. The cube calf also holds something called a book night. There you find a lot of participation of foreigners. I like this, I'm making the noises. Live performances. They say make you live and go. You know see time they go. You know see as your mates they go. They don't leave you go. They say why you be waste your time. Say make you fall in yeah you see this is why we go with you know the different age brackets when they show the not life and the fun and all that because they literally show you things that fits your age yes you know yes. what i'm saying we'll things that we've never been before you know and we'll bring the kids before. too yeah 100 percent. we not those rowdy party shake my booty oh <laughs> We passed that. Uh, okay, we did that. Oh All right. my goodness. We, we in the family friendly, good food, good mm -hmm, vibes. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm I'm trying to just hold back my emotions. Like y'all be calling us Pan African is whatever it's called, <laughs> Pan African is, and we be like we just love people and we love to you know show the goodness of people and the goodness. Yeah, yeah. And bring people together and. I talk about this often, but the diaspora wars and people, you know, y'all are not African and we don't want to be African. You know, the diaspora wars. We haven't heard that in a minute, though. Yeah, like, because we don't 
follow that stuff on social media. Yeah. But to know that there's those group of people on both sides who mm -hmm. feel that way. And to see his picture in Abuja, Nigeria. Talk about it, yeah. Abuja, Nigeria. Man, that's love. That's love. That's what's up. I just had to pause for a minute. Your soul is a feeling that we never know. You've a damn of what they say or don't. I'd be damned if I would lose my soul. Keep burning, take it to the top. Keep burning, don't you let like it stop? Okay. For the feeling that we never know. What's the point if you just let it go? As you didn't walk with the go. Then go to talk with the go. Oh, okay. she don't blow the go. And then we go to punch you go. So make you take your time I can't go for your life You need to wake them up And then they talk to them Hey-ha! Mr. Fatou, they keep them time Mr. Fatou, they keep them space Mr. Fatou, they pay them mind They won't see my face so she's like a local artist that everybody knows in Abuja. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Or he's just like one of these local uh, live performances that just come through to the spot. Like I'm pretty sure he have more music and tunes that people like to check out. Let me know in the comment section which of these activities yeah. have been the explore yeah, that was and try. Okay, yeah, dope video. I have a lot of new views. Yeah. I must say, I didn't know that the the activities was this like live you know mm -hmm. what i'm saying like everybody canoeing then you got the balls yeah. in the water then the hiking and the aerobics which is dope mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying and i always did mention at some points like hiking is not something that i would be into just about but <laughs> seeing them do it on this level having you know, everybody's fun. having fun in mm -hmm. the big groups like that it's, it changed the perspective a little yeah, yeah yeah um i know like in places like atlanta i follow people in atlanta they do a lot of like the hiking groups yeah i've seen yeah. stone mountain and all of that so that is cool. Mm -hmm. um, again, we're not from areas that have mountains, so we don't really hike like that. Right. Uh, no, we don't. Not not really like that. We go we for a don't. jog, yo. <laughs> like, we do a long jog, yeah. like in the neighborhood, literally, on the mm -hmm. highway and all that. Yeah. Or they do biking, cycling, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. a lot of that. Yeah, so this was a cool video. Saw a different side of Nigeria that we have not seen before. Facts. Um, so yeah, if y'all want us to see more of Nigeria, we love videos like this. Travel, world travel. All right. Um, and more of the culture as well. Mm -hmm. So we hope you guys enjoyed this video with us. Like this video, subscribe, turn on the post notification bell. We have enabled our super, super thanks. thanks if you like to support the channel that way, as well as our reaction request form is in our description box below. We'll see you soon. Peace. Peace.